Hello everyone, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. In today's video, I'm going to be setting up my owl paper journal for the week of August 12th. So if you're interested in seeing this, please be sure to stay tuned. Okay, you guys, thank you so much again for tuning in. In case you are new here, my name is Brandy Janae. And on this channel, we do planning, we do budgeting, cash envelopes, stuffing, savings challenges, the whole nine. I do occasionally post teacher content as well as I am now a new travel vlogger. <laughs> so if any of those things sound interesting to you, please be sure to not only hit the like button on your way in, but also hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I post a new video as I continue on my journey to plan my life and plan my budget. I would love to welcome each and every single one of you to the Brandy Janae family. So with all that being said, our quote for today says, being deeply loved by someone gives you strength while loving someone deeply gives you courage. And that's by Lao Tzu. Um, so beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Again, in case you're new here, this is from Bloom Planners. And it is like a year's book of diff different quotes and scriptures and things. And I love it. I do have the link for this shop in the description box, as always, along with my shop and any other information that I feel is necessary for you to know. All right, so again, I have my owl paper journal and it's so beautiful. This is a handmade cover by, I think her name is Marissa, um, but this is like literally she sewed it herself and I just think it's gorgeous. <clears throat> um, and so this is what, oh, I covered it up, but yeah, owl paper. Um, and I have mine, I did go ahead and pre-order the new one. Um, but I have mine in this, like, it's like a coral color and it says the night owl by owl paper. I believe that she's no longer going to call them the night owls. I think it's just going to be like an owl paper planner moving forward, but I did pre-order mine because you guys, this V6 size is literally out of all of the planners I've ever used. <laughs> this is my favorite size. I love how compact it is. I love the paper in this one and I just really I just I don't know it's just perfect it's perfect for just about any bag that I carry um and it doesn't feel overwhelming to me because the I love the Hobonichi cousin but it always felt like very overwhelming to me um just because of the size so this is the current week that we are in I'm actually filming this today on Monday the 5th um, because I'm trying to like get ahead again because I fell behind when I went on vacation. So I have these super cute stickers from Sweet Tea Plans. So for this page, really all I'm going to do is just add a couple stickers because I want to know where I'm going to put them. As far as like the deco and stuff, I'll go back and do that later. But I want to know, you know, which ones I'm going to have left for two of the daily spreads that I decide to put up front. So I'm not going to be doing a whole, whole lot on this page just because do you really need to see me write all that? Probably not. But yes, so on the 12th, my students come back to school. I actually go back on the 7th. Um, for like, you know, teacher institute and classroom setup and all that jazz. And typically, <laughs> I take the opportunity to set my classroom up beforehand. But you guys, this year, I just decided I, I don't want to. Like, I don't, I don't want to, you know, really devote a bunch of time to that this year. Just because I have done that for so many years in the past that this year, I'm like, nope, I'm putting my foot down. So I am going to be doing, it'll probably just be one classroom setup video this year um, that I will more than likely go and do tomorrow is the plan. 
So, but yeah, that's going to be it. Like I'm not, I just decided this year that I did not want to devote a bunch of my time. Um, like I have in years past, I would like to put some washi on here. I kind of wish I would have thought about that beforehand, but that's okay. Do I have any school like washi? Um, oh, this will work. It's kind of got some like stationary supplies and I'm here for the colors. Who is this from? Once More With Love? Oh yeah, that's super cute. So we will add, I just kind of like to break up this space a little bit. Oh, washi cutter. Hmm. Okay, I don't know where I put them, so we'll use this ruler from Sweet Kawhi. <laughs> I don't know where my washi cutters are right now. But anyway, I was saying I like to kind of break this space up a little bit so it's not just like word, 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 word. Um, and I did order some scripts from May over at Black Mountain Plans so that I do not have to keep writing the same things over and over. So in this weekly section, I've decided to combine planners. So in the weekly section, because I'm not really a weekly planner, I have come to realize that is so cute. I am making this like the health part. So as you can see, like I have my exercise, which I need to go back and put my dots in. Um, and then for hydrate, this is my blood pressure. And then these are my rings. And down at the bottom, I like to write how many steps I did for the day. So this has been working out for me with the exception of last week, because for whatever reason, last week, I just could not get my planner life together. <laughs> so far, though, that's the first week that I have skipped since I started in this planner. So that's why I'm like, let me go ahead and get ahead so that I won't run into that issue again. Um Okay, so this part is done, and this is a journal, so that's why I'm like lifting it, because I don't want you guys to see. Okay, so this week is what this looks like. I decided to do like this Scooby-Doo theme, which I think is so, so cute. And these stickers are from Robin's Planning Nest, which I do PR for her. That code is also in the description box, but oh my gosh, I love them. So this is Sunday. Typically I do a this week page here, but I think because I don't want to combine the two themes, I'm gonna start Nope, because that's going to throw me off. Okay, so we're going to, I'm going to skip the this week page. I'll go back and do it and just do like a general no sticker this week. Okay, so then we're going to start here on Monday. And these stickers are from Orange Umbrella Co. And then the number of stickers are from Chrissy Ann Designs. And back here, what I typically do is put in my date headers obviously and then i put in a to-do list <clears throat> so we can use these from fern creek i know i have some more to-do lists somewhere but i don't i mean some more to-do stickers <laughs> somewhere in there but i don't feel like looking for them so let's put the to-do list over here. Okay, and then we'll put this to-do list. I like to just kind of change it up sometime over there. And then uh, you know what? Let's just kidding. I forgot this had boxes. Let's actually put this here. Yeah, I forgot this came with the boxes. Put 
this here. That's crooked, but you know, life, I don't know. I'm like, life goes on. And then I'm like, just kidding. Let me try to move it. <laughs> oh, shoot. Don't rip. Don't rip. Moving too fast. Okay. Okay. Oops. That's better. Might still be crooked, but it looks better to me. Okay. And then, since we have this color over here, we will put this one over here. And I will make this my journaling box. And we will put this one over here, also crooked. Will you fit? Hmm. Okay. Wait a minute. Gentle, gentle, gentle. Okay. So let's put the to do's down here. And this will be for my scripture. And then, okay. So journaling box, scripture, my to-do list, to-do list, scripture will go here. And then I'll put some journaling lines on this side. I feel like I want to use this coralish color for my to-do list. Yep, like that. Okay. And then I want pink. Let's see what this one looks like. This is Tombow number 723. Yep, I like that. Nice and bright. So then I literally just go through here. I don't know, guys. For some reason, when I just added this pink, it's totally giving me, like, Saved by the Bell vibes now. <laughs> With all these colors. That's funny. And these lines, as you can see, have no particular rhyme or reason. Uh, but, yes. It just gives me, like, a less intimidating viewpoint of journaling because i've been i've been doing actually really good but i am not a journaler like some people so it's a little more challenging for me to you know just just do it i'm gonna pop a little washi there just to go along with the other one with the weekly page and then let's throw in some deco. I love this backpack. And of course, I have to include my Stanley cups because, I mean, because <laughs> a laptop is essential. I love this little mini planner and then we can add this little notebook here and some random sticky notes cute okay this is so cute all right so that is it, you guys, for this week. Like I said, I'm going to go back and I will add all the words in. 
Um, but at least I have the first couple days done. And then I will go ahead and add some more, you know, I'll do the rest of the week off camera. But if you would like to see what the rest of this looks like, definitely follow me on Instagram because that is typically where I post the pictures of my completed spreads. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Also, do not forget to subscribe to my channel like we mentioned in the beginning of the video. You guys are absolutely amazing. Be safe, be kind, or be quiet, and be well, and I'll catch you in the next one.